Today we are going to walk through printing targets to make a custom LexJet profile. First step is to download the targets from LexJet's website. From LexJet's home page, there's a support link and you'll see ICC profiles there. And there's a custom profile targets folder. And inside there you'll find all of the targets necessary for making your custom profile. There are three targets that you need. Uh, we also have a document that has all three of them if you are printing on a larger roll. For this case, we'll just use page one. We'll save it to the desktop so it's easy to get to. Then in Photoshop, we will open the target up. And the first important step is to make sure we leave the document uncolor managed. Once it opens, we're going to go to File, Print. I'm going to select the correct printer, and in this case, uh, we're going to be using an Epson printer, the 7900. I like to go into page setup first to set my correct page size. Right now I'm using a 24 inch roll so I'm going to use a custom page size of 24 by 15 to give me plenty of room. And I'm just going to say OK. That's all I need to do for my page setup. Next step we need to make sure to set Photoshop's color handling policy to no color management. And from there we can hit print. The print dialog box will come up and we'll hit preferences to get into the driver. Now we're back into the driver but this time we are going to set the color options. For this profile I'm printing to LexJet Sunset Photo E Satin Paper and I'm going to choose Premium Luster Photo Paper 260 because I know that's really the closest match. Uh, if you're using a different media, you just want to choose a media type similar to what you're printing to. Uh, quality options, you just want to set it to whatever you're going to be printing at. For this profile, I wanted at 1440 high speed. And then our color mode, we want set to custom and then off. That's everything we need there. We're going to click OK and then print to send the targets.